Well, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and all this week we are featuring stories related to the detection, treatment, and fight against the disease. Tonight we show you how new technology is allowing patients to avoid one of the most common effects of treatment, hair loss. NBC 26's Raquel Lamel is here to explain. For Suzanne Bloomhuff, does this bring back memories? Yes. <laughs> this blue hat called Cold Cap saved her hair during months of chemotherapy. Having your hair, I think, makes you feel like you're still you. The Cold Cap is new technology for Theta Care Cancer Center in Appleton, but it's been used in Europe for more than a decade, and Bloomhuff was the first to try it here. Experts say it can be used for all types of cancer, but it's more effective on people taking certain types of drugs. It's a gel-filled cap that's kept in dry ice, so they will have to have a partner with them, their capper, as we call it, to help them put the cap on and off. ThetaCare has been using these cold caps since March, and studies show that at least 70% of patients can keep nearly all to half of their hair. I had the caps on a total of eight hours uh, each treatment. So um, they're extremely cold. My caps were minus 32 degrees. During treatments, Bloomhuff says it's important to have a support system there because one person can't do it all. Someone is massaging and spreading the gel out. Someone else also has to help put the cap on and change it out every half hour to keep the temperature cool. It gets tiring because the caps do, I don't know how much the caps weigh, but it makes your neck tired. Bloomhuff had her last chemotherapy treatment in May. She's now cancer free. Keeping you connected in Appleton, Raquel Lamel, NBC 26. On Friday, NBC 26 is teaming up with the Packers to tackle cancer. You can join us for a special showdown game of the week with to appear at Menasha. Packers players will be there to help raise money for the American Cancer Society. Now, if you cannot go to the game, you can watch it on My New 32. Pre-game coverage starts at 630.